Watch high school sports, anywhere. Stream thousands of live and on-demand high school sporting events from any device. Note, all images, picture, music show in the video belongs to the respected owners. Copyright Disclaimer, under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976, allowance is mad for fair use for purpose such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statutes that might otherwise be infringing. Non-profit, educational or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. Thanks for watching and enjoy the game. Traveled south, and I mean way south, to South Florida, Fort Lauderdale, specifically for tonight's game between the Cardinal Gibbons Chiefs of head coach Matt DeBuck and American Heritage, the Patriots of Coach Patrick Sertain. We are glad to be here and bringing you our first ITG Next Florida game of the week after uh, having brought you so many great contests the first half of the season from Georgia as part of our ITG Next Georgia games of the week. But we continue to bring you the best when it comes to high school football, and we've got a good one in store tonight here at Cardinal Gibbons. I'm your host, Phil Jones, going to be on the play-by-play -play tonight. Brandon Pham is with me tonight, as always, making sure that you guys get a, a great view of tonight's game. What a great spot we've got here, high atop the press box here at Cardinal Gibbons. This is going to be a good one tonight, guys. These are two defending state champions, albeit from two different classifications. You've got Cardinal Gibbons, the defending 4A state champions, coming into tonight's game undefeated, 4-0 on the season. American Heritage, they've been a little bit slow getting the season going for a number of reasons. You've had some COVID-related issues. You've had some, uh, I think, two games canceled. That included uh, a big nationally televised game scheduled in Louisiana that did not happen. So the Patriots of Coach Sertain, one and two on the season, but the win was a big one. For those of you in Georgia, you probably heard about Chaminade Madonna handing the Buford Wolves that seven and nothing shocking victory to a lot of us up in Georgia. We did not see that one coming, but that's been the one victory for this American Heritage team. So don't let the one and two record fool you coming into tonight's game. They are going to be a handful for Coach DeBuck's Chiefs tonight. These two teams, though, both, again, no stranger when it comes to winning football. The Cardinal Gibbons Chiefs, again, defending state champions, they won it two years ago under coach Matt DeBuck, who has really done a phenomenal job since taking over here uh, five years ago at the Fort Lauderdale Private School. He has also not only brought championship caliber football here, to Cardinals Gibbons, but he has also stopped what was a year-over-year -year losing streak to American Heritage under Coach Matt DeBuck. These two teams have split the last four years, two games apiece. Last year, though, it was American Heritage who had the upper hand, 23-17, to in a close one. Probably what we're going to have again here tonight, we do want to thank Baker Sporting Goods for bringing you tonight's game. Big thanks to Baker Sporting Goods, uh, making sure that they're outfitting and serving all of the sporting good needs for teams, youth, middle school, high school, across the entire country. That's Baker Sporting Goods, sponsors of tonight's game. You'll be hearing from our friends from Baker Sporting Goods all throughout tonight's broadcast when we go to break. Beautiful night for football here in South Florida. I know a lot of you probably equate South Florida with high humidity, and but not tonight. It is a perfect uh, sea breeze coming off the ocean, located to maybe about a, a uh, maybe a mile from here or so, and it is uh, again feeling quite good here tonight between uh, for this guy game tonight between these two teams. Again, American Heritage, one and two on the season. Again, the one victory, as I mentioned earlier, against Sham or against uh, yeah Shamanade Madonna, who again handed it to Buford seven to nothing a couple of weeks ago. So American Heritage, one victory on the year, has de definitely been a good one. 
We have brought you some great games so far this year, of course, and we're going to be continuing to bring you great football. We are not done with Georgia. We're going to be in Douglas, Georgia, toward the end of the month, bringing you coffee and Warner Robins. Of course, Warner Robins, we were at Warner Robins last week, bringing you the Warner Robins-Lee County game. What a game that was up in Georgia between those two state powerhouses. Warner Robins got the best of the Lee County Trojans. Uh, so we will be bringing you another Warner Robins game, that being back on our ITG Next Georgia site, and that will come at the end of October. This is going to be a packed house tonight before it's all said and done. Crowd late filing in here, but, boy, they are coming in droves from the north end zone. A lot of people out there celebrating, enjoying a good time tonight, getting ready for this one, and they are starting to file in here to Bud Tight Field here on the campus of Cardinal Gibbons. What a beautiful facility this is. Try to take in as much of the sight lines tonight, guys, on our live broadcasts as you can. It is an absolute beautiful place to play football, beautiful landscape for football. We've got the Cardinal Gibbons Chiefs who are assembling down again up in the north end of the field, getting ready to make their way onto the field. Again, Matt DeBuck, what a great job he's done since taking over here. This is his entering his fifth season. Again, has led him to two state championships in the last three seasons, including last year's state championship in route to a eight and one season 10 and three year before that 13 and two in the 2019 state championship season as cardinal gibbons making their way onto the field american heritage not only are they quite the football team but quite the coaching staff again patrick certain the former college and nfl great and, of course, Matt DeBuck also, former Texas Tech great. We're going to take a moment of silence here. And of the Holy Spirit, amen. Strong and faithful God, as we come together for this contest, we ask you to bless the athletes and coaches from Cardinal Gibbons High School and American Heritage High School. Keep them safe from injury and harm. Instill in them respect for one another and reward them for their perseverance. Please bless the parents, fans, and supporters of each school. Lord, lead us to the rewards of your kingdom where you live and reign forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And please remain standing while we honor America with the playing of our national anthem. All right, playing of our national anthem as well as our pregame prayer. As, uh, again, we welcome you back to our live broadcast tonight. It is our first ITG Next Florida. 
broadcast. So again, guys, thanks so much for being a part of our broadcast tonight. We want to encourage you guys to comment during the contest. So let us hear from you. And I'll try to interact with you guys as much as I can tonight during the game. A little bit about these two teams. So if you're familiar and if you have heard our coaches' shows that we've done with both Coach, uh, Coach Patrick Sertain and Coach DeBuck, you know that Cardinal Gibbons, they like to throw it, throw it, and throw it some more offensively. Now, the one thing, though, that's a little bit deceiving when it comes to Cardinal Gibbons, as much as made of their offense, they've got a pretty darn good defense as well. We're going to see both units on display here tonight. All right, we've got the captains for both teams making their way onto the field for American Heritage. It's Jaden Kenlock, 5'11", linebacker, representing the Patriots. And we'll check out the Cardinal Gibbons player. And the assistant coach up here tells me, what number is he, coach? Greg Otten. Greg Otten. American Heritage has won the toss. They're going to defer to the second half. And so we're going to see the powerful Cardinal Gibbons offense on display here tonight to begin the game. So I was talking about American Heritage. Brandon Ennis may be the top wide receiver in the country, transferred to American Heritage in the off season. Now you're gonna see him some at wide out, but he's also gonna line up at quarterback. In fact, when we talked with Coach uh, Patrick Sertain earlier this week, he mentioned to us, although he wouldn't disclose a whole lot, that it's either gonna be Ty Law or Brandon Ennis rotating tonight at quarterback. So we'll see once we get started here tonight exactly who's going to be taking the snaps. For Cardinal Gibbons, we can tell you it's going to be Dylan Risk. He is a junior quarterback, and he is being looked at by several of the Power 5 schools. In fact, you've got a host of players on both sides tonight that certainly are going to be playing on Saturdays next fall if they're seniors. Of course, we've also got some juniors and sophomores, guys, that are also going to be playing at the next level when their time comes. I right, get the picture here, guys. As you can see, you've got American Heritage, the Patriots. They're in their black, white, and gold. The black bottoms. The white jerseys with the black numerals. Cardinal Gibbons, and they're good looking, red, white, and gray. And again, we're gonna see Cardinal Gibbons getting the ball here tonight to start things off. American Heritage, Julian Ramirez is going to kick it off, and here we go. It's high, end over end kick. It's going to hit at the back line of the end zone. That's not going to come out. So we're going to see Cardinal Givens going on offense tonight. First and 10 from their own 20. Sit back, everybody. Welcome in, and thanks so much for being a part. 